assalamu alaikum students of class 7 welcome to your lecture of english this is your instructor miss aisha salim uh, students uh, as you know that uh, i had told you in, your, in the previous video that our uh, syllabus has completed and um, i we have done uh, interrogative narration in the previous video and uh, today we are going to do its worksheet you all have uh, the pile of those worksheet so we are going to do this okay so uh, here is a worksheet uh, you can see here first of all what you have to do is that you have to mention the date and day here okay understood it is compulsory to mention date and day okay and uh, you can see that i have done two sentences here for you so uh, let's start the sentences okay so students number one sentence is he said to me will you come school tomorrow so you can see it's an interrogative sentence and first of all what you have to see is that the, that if the sentence is starting with a helping verb or with a wh family word so you can see that uh, this sentence is starting with a helping verb okay will is a helping verb so you know that if this uh, interrogative sentence in narration if the in interrogative sentence is starting with um, a helping verb so we have to change it with if or whether but if the sentence is starting with wh family word so the word will uh, remain same okay so let's start changing it he said to me will you come to school tomorrow now i had told you that uh, in interrogative sentences said to or say to all these words will be changed into ask okay so you can see that said is a second form of verb here so we have to put second form of ask here so the sentence is he asked me now these commas have changed into if why these 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 have changed into if because the sentence is starting with a helping verb so the sentence is he asked me if i would come school next day okay now you can see here is a helping uh, oh, sorry uh, personal pronoun second person pronoun you so you know that uh, uh, the second personal pronoun will be changed according to the object of reporting speech so i have changed it in i okay uh, then i had told you that if there will be will or shall in a sentence it will be changed according it will be changed into would so if i would come school tomorrow is a time and place word time ye hame time bataya hua yahan pe so that is why this will be changed into say next day so, so the whole sentence will be he asked me if i would come school next day okay next sentence is he said will you listen to me so you can see that this sentence is also starting with the helping verb so the sentence will be like this he asked if okay i had told you that you will be changed into i according to, it will be changed according to the object and here is no object but it will be changed like uh, i he asked if i would listen to him now why i have written him here because you can see that me is a first person and the first person is will be changed according to the subject of the reporting speech and you can see the subject is he so it will be changed like him so the whole sentence will be he asked if i would listen to him okay okay ji next sentence he said is this your book again it's a helping verb so the sentence will be like this she, oh, sorry she said she asked if that was my book okay so you can see it's is here and uh, it's a past tense so uh, uh, in the reporting speech there is a past tense so is will be changed into was as i had told you that uh, uh, a present tense will be changed into past tense so this is a present tense and it will be changed into past so we will use was okay she asked if that book was mine ya phir that was my book okay so next sentence uh, uh, let us do a sentence of a wh family 
so here is the sentence sentence number 7 ali said where are you going okay students we had done uh, three sentences of a helping verb now we are doing one sentence of uh, wh family you can see where is a word of a wh family so uh, let's see uh, what we have to change uh, you know that i had told you that uh, if there will be a uh, helping verb in the start of a sentence uh, it will be changed into if or whether but if there will be a wh family word so it will be remain same so ali said where are you going ali asked so now uh, where will be come uh, down as it is so ali asked where i was going why i have uh, written i here because you is a second person and it will be changed into i okay ali asked where i was going okay so next sentence he said to me sentence number 8 he said to me what are you looking for okay now you can see this sentence is also starting with a wh family word so let us change it he asked me what i was looking for okay students so uh, the uh, remaining sentence will be done by your own self okay on your worksheets as your class work make sure you don't uh, have to send the worksheets to me okay uh, misplaced bhi ho sakti hai so that is why uh, inshallah when you will come in school i will check it in our physical classes okay so students that this was all for today thank you so much take care allah hafiz everyone